hey, two minutes on the term death notice and obituaries. And I get questioned, are these the same? Are they different? Well, kind of like funeral director, mortician, and undertaker all originated as individual terms, they now kind of have this big gray area over them. So death notice and obituary are often interchangeable. Historically, the obituary is a long, elaborate story of the person's life, sometimes written by the newspaper themselves as a highlighted portion in the newspaper, more often written by the family. And it's a more flowery version of the basics of a person's life. Death notice historically was the basics, the person's name, the dates, the funeral home, and when the services were going to be. Now, fast forward, people use those terms interchangeably. However, some newspapers still do a free death notice where you can publish just a public notice that somebody has died and here's their services. More often though, people want to include a few more bits of information so that someone can recognize who that person was within the community. High school they went to, job they worked, church they attended, different community events that they were volunteers for, or who the family was so that people can recognize, oh, so-and-so's child, I know them, I'm their coworker. I went to high school with them. So more so people choose to do an obituary. However, with the increase in pricing within newspapers, online obituaries or websites of the funeral home obituaries are becoming the new trend, which is not helping newspapers, but because of cost, that is kind of where things are going in the future. So death notices, typically short, Obituaries, typically a little more flowery. Those are the two terms, interchangeable, but still do have their own definitions.